The Slave One was the notorious starship of the bounty hunter Jango Fett, and later his son Boba Fett. Manufactured by Kuat Systems Engineering as the Fire Spray class patrol and attack craft, these ships' original purpose was to guard planetary prison complexes and recapture any inmates attempting to escape. However, only a handful of them were ever made due to their limited uses at the time. Jango Fett ended up stealing one during an early mission on the prison moon of Uvo 4. Because it was originally a patrol ship that was designed for temporary flight missions, Django was required to make extensive modifications to the Slave 1. Under his ownership, he drastically expanded its weapon and defensive systems, upgraded its engines and interior compartments to better suit long travels, and modified its original prisoner cages to be turned into coffin-like cabinets to increase his carrying capacity of captured bounties. One of Django's design choices for the Slave 1 was to make it appear deceptively weak, with only the twin tail blaster cannons being plainly visible from a distance. All the other weapon systems were hidden under compartments, including a missile launcher that opened at the tail of the ship, two additional laser cannons located at the ship's body, and a mine layer system at the rear. A rotating capsule surrounded both the pilot and passenger sections, ensuring that they were always kept upright whenever the ship made tight maneuvers or landed horizontally. Underneath the passenger seats was the engineering console room, with a manhole hatch near it covering a ladder which leads deeper into the lower engines of the ship. When the Slave 1 came into the ownership of Boba Fett, he went on to make more modifications. He replaced the coffin-like cabinets with six immobilizing bunks that were packed inside a clear view cage, located within the center of the ship. Boba's own sleeping quarters were a level above outfitted with only the basic needs, as all the upgrades from both bounty hunters left the ship tightly cramped. Extra weapon systems were also added, including additional proton torpedo launchers, an ion cannon, tractor beam, and general upgrades to the previous armaments. Boba also upgraded the shields of the ship and installed advanced sensory systems alongside a military-grade jamming and masking device, allowing him to stay hidden from most enemy craft sensors while also being able to track them at a far distance without their knowledge. Overall, the Slave 1 was originally built to be nothing but a simple patrol craft with limited purposes in mind. However, after falling into the hands of both FETs and undergoing drastic modifications under their ownerships, it has become one of the most advanced and dangerous ships in the galaxy, one that became perfectly suited for bounty hunting.